Yo, what's up guys? It's Kyan here, Fitness Angelo. I'm actually about to go to the gym. Uh, check out the new place. Check out the new kitchen, guys. It's pretty sick. It's a little apartment. But... Got Ian over there. Check it out, guys. Um, about to try out the new strawberry margarita from Cellucor. Shout out to Cellucor for sending me this. Um, I got this and a green apple. And the green apple is delicious. So you guys about to see my first impression on this bad boy. Yeah. Alright, so what's up guys? Um, let's try this out, huh? Uh, I tried the orange one and the blue raspberry one and everything Sunday Core makes on point. But they're quite expensive. Um, check out the color. It's kind of like pink. Oh my god, this smells so smell that Ian. It doesn't even it doesn't it smells like watermelon in the way. It smells like a sweet tart. Yeah, it's like a sweet tart smell. Got water right here. Got the water right here, guys. So let me get the scoop. I think the sun course, the C4 scoop has gotten smaller. If I don't, if I recall, I don't know. What do you guys think from the old study course? So let's take two scoops in there. Two scoops. Two scoops, guys, give you three grams of beta alanine, two grams of creatine nitrate, two grams of arginine AKG, and 700. 41 times 741 times 2 whatever that is explosive energy blend so I'll put that in there and I also drink my creatine mono um, if you guys are wondering what kind of creatine I'm taking right now I was taking optimum nutrition guys but then I haven't ordered that online I got the regular body tech from vitamin shop it was like 10 bucks for this whole thing um, just make sure guys creatine is 5 grams or 1 teaspoon bam it doesn't matter when you take it how you take it as long as you take it every day, be consistent with it, you'll see all types of gains. Um, let's go and try this out. Put the top on. I really like, enjoy these uh, blender bottle guys compared to other bottles because you hear that clack, that click right there when you when you close the top. It does not leak, which is something I'm really, really, really digging. Especially with a lot of shaker cups, they leak a lot and they break easily. So Ooh, you can hear the fizz. You guys can see that. Shout out to my boy Chris Jones. <laughs> Hella funny. It's good. It's really good. Um, the good thing I like about Silly Core C4, guys, I'm not being paid by them. I'm not being sponsored by them. I'm just talking about it because it's so damn good. But it, it mixes hella well. And the taste, it doesn't even taste like pre workout. It tastes like a regular juice drink. So if you guys are interested, get one of these. If you don't, don't get them. But yeah, guys, let's go to the gym. Hey, what's up, guys? Um, today it's Monday, March 25th. I'm actually gonna go to the gym right now. I'm actually gonna pick up Ian first from school, and then we're gonna head out to go in, to the gym. Um, just thought I'd do a little vlog for today. Um, it's actually finals week right now, guys. Um, I have my biology lab quiz tonight, and then I have my bioelectric exam on Wednesday night. So I've been studying a lot, um, studying as much as I can, basically. So now, um, today's upper light day. Feels good. Um, I'm just trying to get over this little sick that I'm having. Um, I was having a little cold. <sighs> My throat was hurting. And uh, well, one thing I just want to keep you guys an update on. Um, I'm actually having knee pains guys, so it's been having since before the Arnold. So it's been a while now, I've been having a little knee pain on my left knee. I've talked to Steve Clevo about it and um, Alberto Nunez. So I'm planning to just take off take off lower days for a couple of weeks. Um, this is actually the first week that I'm going to take a lower days off. So I'll just see how that works and hopefully I'll recover from it right. Um, I've been doing a lot of mo more mobility, um, a lot more foam rolling self myofascial release um, doing a lot more dynamic stretching after working out and yeah I think I think if the pain is due to the fact that I was probably doing a lot lack of mobility and um, yeah it takes a toll on you at the end and this is what happens so make sure you guys do your mobility and make sure you guys stay on top of that man because um, it sucks right now to be honest 
Um, the pain comes and goes, so it's not like it's constant pain all the time, but it's there definitely when, whenever there's a flexion or a extension or anything along those lines or a rotation, I definitely feel the pain. And this guy in front of me did not know how to drive. What the heck are they doing? But yeah guys, other than that, that's the update so far. So I'm basically going to do a lot of upper body now. For a little bit until the pain goes away. So, yep. Other of you guys wondering, where do I get my hair cut, right? Well luckily, um, since I was a kid, I've had my mom to cut my hair. So ever since then, I've been trying to save up money basically. And she's been doing great at it, clearly. Uh, it's awesome. I have like my own little personal barber. So to answer that question, I have uh, my parents. My parents helped me cut my hair, my mom. To be exact, so she cuts my hair and it's been looking good since then. I've never trusted anyone else with my hair, so yeah. If you guys are wondering, basically I do a one at the bottom and then a two at the at the mid top, and all that at the top. Um, my mom uses some scissors and some thinning, some thinning uh, scissoring so to work on that. So that's pretty much it. If you guys are interested. And yeah guys, so check out Steve Clever's channel. I'll put his channel somewhere here. I think Slav, Slav Nation. Um, his channel is putting out great information guys, especially out, uh, those out, especially for those who are out there to look for uh, powerlifting tips and advices. So I really recommend checking that out. Um, shout out to Steve Clever. So check out his channel guys, really high quality videos, quality information about powerlifting. And yep, check it out. Hey, what's up, guys? Um, just got done working out for upper light. Definitely, definitely feeling good right now. Um, hit a PR on the dumbbell incline. I hit 65 pounds on the dumbbell incline for uh, five sets of eight to ten. Um, I for the first three sets, I think I got ten, and then for the last two sets, I got eight. Definitely feeling good. Um, feeling big. Overall, in general, um, right now it's 2.22, so the workout took about two hours, and it was me and Ian, and yeah. Now about to go home, probably get something to eat, and I'll show you guys what I'm going to eat. And then I have to head out to school, guys. Got to hit the library, right, to get more studying done before this uh, lab quiz coming up. So, hope you guys stay tuned, and catch you guys when I'm home. Alright, what's up, guys? Just got home from the gym. And now basically about to take a shower. Yo, what's up guys? It's Kyle here. So I'm about to you guys. I just got out of the shower. It smells good. I'm about to go to school in a little bit. I'm gonna show you guys what I'm eating right now. Um just wanna get something real quick. Maybe some milk. And let's see what else should I eat. I think that's all for right now. Um I know a lot of you guys are wondering what my macros are. To be honest guys, I haven't been counting macros. macros. Um, I've just been keeping an eye on my fats, make sure it's not too high with fats, you know, and make sure I get my fruits and vegetables, and uh, make sure I hit my protein. So, if you guys can see the pantry. It's a new pantry, check it out. Um, this is what we Asians eat. Um, what I'm going to eat today is probably some scoop of a uh, soy corway. This is the Moen chocolate. Super delicious. Um, if you guys are familiar with the, that chocolate, um... Whoppers, tastes exactly like right. delicious. So I'm gonna have that and I'm gonna have one of these. If you guys are Indonesian, you guys know what this is. It's Indomie, guys. Super good. Uh, let me read you guys the macros. For this whole thing is 14 grams of fat, 46 grams of carbs, two grams of fiber, and eight grams of protein. So I'll eat this, that, and I think that's pretty much it for now, and yeah guys, so let's make this food and I'll show you guys when it's all finished. Alright, there you go guys, I have the noodles cooking right here, um, got the whey protein shake right there, and got the little seasonings and stuff over here, and I'm probably going to add an egg, one egg in there, just to make it taste better. Ugh. Yeah. So there you go, and I'll catch you guys when it's finished. All right, guys. So this is what it looks like. Looking good, smelling good. That's my little dog, Milo. Say hi, Milo. Oh, look at him. He's so cute. 
and have my shake right here. Post workout meal, guys, and watching a good YouTube channel, Omar. Give a big shout out to my boy Ricky for sending me one of these tanks. Check out his YouTube channel, guys. Ricky, check it out. The guy's nasty, aesthetic as heck. Um, he's a new YouTube channel, so check his channel out, guys, as always. And uh, thanks, Ricky, again for the shirt. It's really nice, really nice quality. And yeah, much love, bro.